Welcome to Selected Solutions. So today we are going to add pipes in the Hecra Studio. And if you are new to this channel, please don't forget to subscribe to get updates on our latest videos. Now open the Rust Mapper and then we on our terrain and to the area we have first to add a connection uh, to the connection this one uh, we add it as a brake line uh, later we are going to uh, uh, convert this into to the connection so when we go to the geometric data it editor and then we have to add a profile for our uh, this one for our pipe so we click on our profile lines and then we click add or edit this one and we export this as our shape files so that we can load this one in our geometric data editor later so uh, you have to save edits of this one save edits and then we enforce the brake lines to our 2d to the area so that's it this will be enforce and we take save edits and right after this we <coughs> we go to the our geometric data editor geometric data is it and we zoom to that area this one so we edit this it's uh, cell spacing we can say 10 by 10 and then we enforce break line and then we uh, convert this brake line into to the area connection okay so this is the connection and we edit the connection so that's it that's, that's the terrain and now we have to add our pipe in terms of culvert uh, but here we still have not imported so we import the barrel of the one we created previously the pipe using the profile lines okay so we that's it so we we have now the pipe appearing so just sloppy similar with 16.72 with the GIS station and then we input the coefficient let's say 0 0.5 then 0 0.15 0 0.15 and this one the upper upper elevation and the lower elevation so we click measure so that we will know the upper elevation and the lower elevation of the pipe that we have uh, added so click on the control that's it and to the lowest point So the profile so it's 313 and 310 so that is where the elevation that we are going to put so click edit the connection and then 
on covert so 300 okay so click ok and the, uh, don't forget to put the diameter at the upper right corner so this is the covert and we have to save the geometric data save uh, geometric data yes okay so we have now our pipe culvert long culvert actually okay that's it so what we do next is to run the simulation we are ready to run the simulation so we go to the across main then run the unsteady flow analysis compute okay so this is just uh, fast so wait for it okay so after this we can now see you see here in the bottom section because of the pipe it's already flowing even though the water is not yet uh, uh, reaching this point so that's how easy it is guys to add pipe